Hey there, here we are, rodeo season, and we've dusted off our 10 gallon hat and pulled our boots out of the closet, and we are ready to go on an adventure called the Wild West, so let's get to it and see what's up with this town. So let's go look, I see signs to read, and rule books some to read, let's see what that says. Okay, so it looks like your typical, oh, no robbing shops, you must use coins. Okay, I cannot get the texture pack to come up, so we're using Chroma Hills. And I prefer to use signs, it's not much reading. You are allowed to mine up ore, craft them into tools in the mines, you are allowed to make up an LP. Okay, well, you know I love to read, so don't worry about that. Bring on the signs. Okay, so let's see. Four gold per drink. Okay, I have 64 gold it looks like. Whoops. So let's see what this says. If I can read this. Hold on. Let's get over here. Ah, darn it. Come on, I can do it. I just spent all that time jumping in the uh, Mesa Valley. Okay, there we go. Isaac says, want another drink? Sure. Don't worry, this one is on me. And he pays the bartender. There you go, just hit the button and see what you get. But look out for the poison. Okay, so he says to go get our drink now. Oh! Oh my gosh, is that what he meant by the poison? Oh no, the villager, sorry guy. <laughs> that's too funny. Uh, okay, that's much better. I got the beer, the villager got the poison in the face. <laughs> but it hit me too, so I don't know. Alright. Um, okay, so we got our drink. I am not drinking that, because I'll bet you it's probably got nausea effect or something. Yep, yep, what did I tell you? 100% speed, 600, ooh, 650% attack damage. Well, that's nice, but I think I'm going to hang on to that for later. Okay, so Isaac says, have you heard about this crime boss named Alonzo? And I say, I've only heard rumors. Well, apparently he has a gang uprising and he is planning on taking over West Point. We'd better be careful then. Let's see, Isaac says, you know what? We should get some gear just in case. Why don't you use your gold and walk around West Point and buy some gear? All right. Okay, so we come back here after we have bought some gear. Alrighty, so where can we buy some gear? Oh my god! <laughs> what is this? No! Poor cow! <laughs> oh, that's too sad. This can be you. Hmm. Uh, okay, so we need to buy some gear. Okay, this is Gus's house. What is this? This is my house. Alright. Well, I'm pr pretty sure I can take stuff out of my house, so let's uh, take this. Oh, let's take this. Alright, and it's not time to sleep yet, so we'll leave that there. Oh, poor cow. <laughs> what is this? Uh, this is Isaac's house. Don't enter till I have permission, and I'm not done talking to him at the saloon, which is there. Oh, wow. Oh, these guys. Okay, what is this? The food market. No, no, I don't want to trade. I want to get in. Let me in. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So, what is this? Meat, three gold. Vegetables, mm, extra sweets and woo, pumpkin pie, I'll take one of them. What is that, three gold for a pumpkin pie? Okay, what else? Cookies, apples, bread, mm, okay, let's go see what they have in the meat section. Any pork chops? I hear cooked pork 
chops is the way to go. I will pay you gladly. You want to pay him one, two, three, four, sixteen pork chops and black. This is a busy food market. Oh, thank you. Okay, saloon, food market. What's down here? What is this? Oh, here we go. No, that's the bank. Okay, what? Ooh. Ender chest? Pretty. A uh, banker says, hello, you can keep your coins in here and we'll make sure we transport your coins through El Cueste. But please note, we are not responsible for lost coins. These are tough times right now. Yeah, that sounds a little shady if you ask me. Okay, so you can buy an ender chest. Uh, who is this? West Point Jail. Ooh, what you in for? Horse, horse stealing? You know they hang you for that, right? Okay. Oh gosh. Um, Sheriff Cora. Okay, Sheriff Cora says, "What do you want? I'm on a tight schedule here. You, let's see. You want to know about the other items you need to get? Well, tell you what. I'll tell you." If you can do something for me, I need your help to make a criminal admit to the crime he has done. We have him under arrest right now, and we're not letting him go until he admits to his crime. His name is Gus, and you will find him in his house. Okay, I remember seeing Gus's house. We just walked past that. Okay, so we have to go talk to Gus. But I still need... Some stuff. Who is this? Oh, weapon shop. That's what I need. Alright. Uh, the whip. Mm, no, I don't want that. Stone knife. Five coins. What is this? Iron knife. Eight coins. Ooh, pistol. Fifteen gold. Okay. So, fifteen gold for a pistol. And what does that say? Five gold for a stack of ammo. So what is that, 20? Let's split this up. Uh, 15. Five. Oops. Five. Okay, there we go. Okay, so now we got us a pistol and some ammo. And yeah, let's get an iron knife. What they say an iron knife was eight coins. Nine minus oops. One. Alright, let's go see what they got. Armor is upstairs. Let's go up here. Ooh. Uh leather, iron, gold, and ooh, diamond. The diamond is stolen. Okay, let's go for the iron. Oh wait, where is it? Okay, iron. Here's leather. That's nice. That looks like western gear. Okay. Here's iron. Definitely want some iron. Is that 12 gold? 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Alright. There we go. So now we've got our armor. We are ready to go take on some bad guys. Where are my boots? Oh. Okay, what's out here? A balcony. Okay, so let's go. Woohoo! Alrighty, so let's see. What do we need to do now? Go to Gus's house? That's the food market, I can tell, because all the guys are there. Uh, Gus's house is down here by the hanging, hanging cow. Gus's house. Enter if you have permission. I do, and Gus has apparently escaped. Let's see. I didn't do anything. Oh, you're not the police. So, who are you? Okay, I am Granny's, and I am here to get some information out of you. Let's 
Missy, so the chief thinks she can hire someone to get me to talk. You're lucky I'm still in here. You got nothing out of him, so let's head back to the chief. He ain't talking. Chief, he's not talking. Where are you? Jail. Jail this way. Woohoo! Uh oh, I'm getting hungry already. Alright, let's go tell the chief that Gus is not cooperating. Okay. Sheriff, he is not talking. Hmm, I have an idea. If you have any kind of weapon, I would threaten him with it. Head back to Gus. You did... A, okay, head back to Gus. Alright, Gus, you're in trouble now, because I'm going to threaten you with my iron sword. Oh, cow, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, in the door. Okay, so I come back. He sees you pulling out a weapon. Stop, I'll talk, yes. I stole some gold from a mine, but that was only because... And the chief walks in and says, That's all I need to hear, Gus. Gus says, But my family is starving. We needed that gold. I do not care, says the chief. Say goodbye to your family because I sentence you to be hanged. What? You can't do this. Yes, I can. We're in a poor situation right now, and your stealing didn't help. Enjoy the rest of your time in your house, because your hanging is in a few days. Okay, grannies, meet me back in my office. I will talk now. Okay. Ooh, the sun's going down. Okay, you better talk fast, because I need to go sleep in my bed. I better put my weapon away before I go into the sheriff's office. You know how they can be. Alright, you did a good job, Steve. Now, about your items. They are located in a place called Scorpion Rock. Um, an old mine shaped like a scorpion to scare off the bandits. The items you want are spider eyes. In fact, they each contain some weird mystical power. The rock is right by the bridge you went to before. Okay. I didn't go to a bridge, did I? Uh-oh. Alright. Our house is down here by the poor cow who is still <laughs> hanging by his neck. Hey, get out of my house. That's my house. You better not be in my bed. Alright. We'll set this so it's daytime. Okay, now... Let's see, what are we doing now? We are... Okay. Oh yeah, we gotta head out towards... Oh wait, we have to go back to the saloon. That's right, we forgot all about Isaac. Okay, Isaac said... Where did he say that? We better be careful then. Let's use some gear. Why don't you use, walk around, buy some gear. Okay. Welcome back, grannies. Got everything you need? Yes. Isaac says, good. And he thinks for a second. You know, grannies, there might be a way we can stop Alonzo and his drug gang. Did they have drug gangs back in the Wild West? <laughs> I didn't even think drugs were illegal back then. Meet me at my house. We'll discuss how... We'll discuss how there my house is the tallest house. Okay. Oops. So let's go see the tallest. This looks pretty tall to me. Isaac's house. Do not enter unless you have permission. Are you taking a bath in Isaac's uh, porch? Okay. So Isaac, what do you have in your furnace? It's very tempting. So Isaac says, Good, you made it. Now let's start. I've been hearing about special items all scattered throughout El Cueste. These items were given to us by some foreigners who had visited us many years ago. But during the gold rush, the items have women. But during the gold rush, the items have some strange glow on them. I believe if we find all of these items and combine their powers, we may be able to stop Alonzo. I think I might have an idea of where the first two items are. If I were 
remember correctly, the items are two swords in a, in a bridge between two mountains called Mount Goldmore. To get there, we can take a train, which is behind the windmill, or we can walk. Alright, meet you there. Hmm. Okay, well, let's eat us a pork chop real quick. See if we can find the train station. I wonder if I should bring a bed with me. Eh, probably not. But just in case, I think I'm going to. Where did I see a bed? Somebody had a bed. I don't know. I could steal Gus's bed. I think he had a bed. No, this is this is not Gus's house. Sorry. Wrong house. Bank. No, no, no. Let's go take Gus's bed. He's not going to need it anyway. He's getting hanged in a few days. Yeah. Thank you, Gus. I appreciate it. Okay, so train station. Ooh, that's a cool windmill. Okay, let's go. I see something back there. I like that windmill. That's nice. Very well done. Okay. Do -do -do. Don't see any bad guys around yet. Let's see. The train station. Ten gold per ride. Well, I better be getting some gold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, there's my ten gold. Uh, let's see, to Mount Goldmore. Where does this one go? To Hel Halaku Village. Ooh, there's another village. Well, they haven't said anything about the village yet, so... I'll put my bed right there. No, not in my hand. Um, okay, am I going to be able to flip this lever? Uh, no. Alright, well... Just, oh, there we go. Alright. I guess that was just a turn it on. Woo! Train ride! <laughs> yeah, we don't want to go back on it again. Okay, so here we are. This must be... Wow, that's dangerous. Oh, there's the... Something. That must be the mines. Oh, do you see that in the distance? That looks like a scorpion, doesn't it? That's nice. Cool. We can't see that other village, but I think that's way off that way. Alright, let's see. What does he say? Isaac. Oh, that's right. Isaac came with us. Here we are. The Goldmore Mountains. The items we need to retrieve are two golden swords from each mine. Good luck getting the swords. I don't know how dangerous the mines are. Read after getting the swords. Okay, so how do we get down to the mine. Is there... Uh, that doesn't look like it. Maybe this way. Yeah, okay, that looks better. So I guess we just have to jump down there. Woo! Ouch! Uh, this is the West Mine. Only enter if you have permission. Well, he did tell us to go to the mine, so I would say we have permission. Uh, just in case, let's go see what this is. This is probably going to be something like the East Mine. Do, 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 do. The East Mine. Okay, so we do have permission, so I guess, I guess let's go down the East Side first. Oh, golly, it's dark! Dark! Oh shoot, and I hear guys! No, 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 no! Oh, 
well, I guess that worked out pretty well. Can I take this out? Oh, shoot. Uh, why can't I take that out? There we go. Yeah, you know what I say to that? And you know what? I should have grabbed some... Oh, is there... Okay, but I don't have any wood. Well, let's go back up because I can't do a playthrough without some light. So let's go... We're going to have to... Um, I didn't see anybody selling torches, though. So, let's see. Let me go run back to town and see if maybe somebody... Oh, there's a ladder. That's how we were supposed to get down. Huh? I guess we'll go up that way. Uh, so I'll be right back. <laughs> 